Mbacho ay mo haya o yete. Mauritania coach. Me name a a couple of days ago. And I opened Ghana, you man, Anna. That's this year. And I told him, said, maybe Sam said, Ghana is looking for a coach. I said, he is aware. And maybe Sam said, will he be interested? And I said, why not? Who would not like to coach a country like Ghana? But nobody has contacted me. This was a conversation between myself and the coach of Mauritania. Into me, he said, whether he has to apply or he has been shortlisted, he said, but he yeah. is available, and from his yeah, comments, yeah, 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 positively yeah. said, yeah. who coached Ghana, no? <laughs> Hello, y'all. Yeah. Nana, what's it make up? It's okay, I'm going to say, you might wait a second, you might wait a second, ah, obi a wo, who can wo amu di coach do ya ba Ghana? It's a way there, okay, a simple job, ma'am. Anyway, Menenakasa uh, and say if they contact him in the next 24 hours, and I said they've already contacted him. As I said, Menenakasa a couple of days ago may train the feedback, but what basically he's saying is he's available. So he could be somebody we've seen his handiwork. The Hawaii Ama Mauritania over the last couple of years, and I said when he took over, you can see his handiwork and his fingerprints. What do you say? The guy has a philosophy. And he's a young coach, you know. In the end, I don't know the, the the coaches that have been shortlisted and the amount of money that has been earmarked for my salaries. But for him to say, say, yes, I'm aware Ghana is looking for a coach. Yes, why wouldn't why would I not be interested? And then, of course, nobody has contacted him yet. Those are three key factors that we need to also bear in mind. I know they are exclusive to uh, Max FM this morning. Ah, uh, thank you very much. Ah, uh, Bayana Usha, Coach Ben Agana for Bakofa. Well, Nana, um, I read somewhere say, Hey, Rena is not. Uh, we cannot. Ghana cannot afford Hey, Rena. That is what I've read. But officially, we've not seen any such communication. I think it was an FA member who may have made that remark, but. When you say we cannot afford, how much are we talking about? And when you say we cannot afford, can we not bring our heads together? If a buying can only promise 50,000. It would be hope on the FA to try and add up the balance by also in and reaching out to corporate Ghana to close the gap. But anyway, let's see the kind of coach. For me, Nana Unim said, I've always said, it ain't get coaching problem alone. It is not a coaching problem alone. There, there's a whole range of issues that need to be dealt with from bottom up, up down, in order for Ghana to get back to, you know, walking gradually back to health. Right now, Ghana is in the coma in ICU, and it is not just about bringing in a coach. The, the drip will not rescue Ghana. It is beyond just a drip. We need more than that. And I'm sure those tasks or given the responsibility to manage Ghana football would be the first to admit that. And they should stop this. Kwame Ekritis, Kwame Onye Nipa, he's against us. Kofi on criticizing. Delay. That kind of mentality is retrogressive. It is uh, prehistoric, and you will not get anywhere with that. Open up, take criticism, and respond to your critics positively. But who oh, eliminate, eliminate or alienate half the media, a quarter of the media, because they criticize you? Are you are actually digging your own grave? But I know they listen to this show all the time. That is my message to the FA. I'm a member of the FA by virtue of Ghana Beach Soccer. But that does not stop me from expressing my views as a Ghanaian, a citizen, and a very concerned journalist with regards to the state of our football. I mean, I'm not, last member, Nama Amibi immigration. She was not happy at all. She was not happy at all. And you are also part of the system. You are part of the GFA. What? are you doing 
then it makes you feel safe. Start to the FA, we need to set up and tell certain truths regardless of the consequences. And if you be tagged or labeled, that is the least of our worries when we try to push in and do the right thing. Hi. Ankara. <laughs> All right. Yada, Sonia Sonia Kasene, save Jenny back. Yo, Dana. But that's it. All right. That's former BBC sports journalist, current president of Ghana Beach Soccer Association, and our very own head of sports here at IMAX Media. Yao Ampo for Ankara. Yao Star Ankara. You know, like. All right, back to you, Josiah. Anna? Yeah. Yeah, my idea today, 